Hi there. So I know as a um, as a business owner myself that one of the most difficult things is to uh, find a way to get a steady flow of clients. Um, I know it's really um, like really the number one problem that people come to me with and that I help people with is they want to find a way to have that predictable flow of clients. And it makes, you know, it makes sense. Um, you want to have control over your income um, and your time. And this is really what's going to give you um, the freedom and that ability to, you know, to really have, uh, have work that fits around your life, right? So you can make your life a priority um, versus the other way around, which is what it's like when you're working for someone else. You have to fit, you know, you have to fit your life around um, around work requirements. So, you know, that's no fun, right? We don't want that. So, okay. So is there actually, you know, a marketing strategy that's better for health coaches um, and, you know, something that can really put you in charge of your client flow? And um, here's my advice on that front. So the thing is, um, one of the most important things, there are really two things. So one is you want to be following the advice of someone who really is focused on helping people in health and wellness. That's really critical because what you're doing is so different than other types of businesses. And you really need to have someone who kind of understands that because of the type of people that you're trying to attract, right? So this is a very, uh, health is a very sensitive topic. Most people have been um, absolutely burned before. They're skeptical. Um, so you need some kind of marketing strategy that's going to take that into consideration and help you create like the right messaging and and really be able to lay that foundation um, that you're going to be able to build your your client flow off of. So so that's critical. So it's got to be really someone who specializes only in health and wellness. And then the other thing is the uh, the most successful marketing strategies are going to be the ones that you do consistently. So you know, what I've seen is uh, really success in this sort of thing is shaped like a hockey stick, right? So, you know, you kind of start off and, you know, you, you're not seeing much movement, but then things start to pick up and then boom, it really, it really shoots up. Um, but the only way you get it to that point that where it's going to shoot up, you know, uh, shoot up like that is if you've been consistent and it's, you know, consistency over over a longer period of time, that's what's going to get you the results. You know, this reminds me of like when I um, when I was exercising. Uh, one of the things that you know I kind of grappled with, especially when I had to commute into the city and like you know I had to like I had to get up at like five o'clock and and work out. Um, do before I left for work. I I could not actually work out after work. There was just my brain didn't work that way. Um, so I was like, okay, so should I, you know, wake up at five o'clock and do an hour of exercise and try and do that, you know, three days a week, or, you know, I would try all these different combinations. And the thing that worked the best for me was actually just doing 20 minutes a day. I had a Nordic track still do. Um, and, uh, yes, I, I do use it on occasion. Um, and just doing that 20 minutes a day, having that consistency of doing that, you know, the, the five days a week actually is what made the biggest difference for me in my health um, when I was looking to kind of, you know, just stay healthy and, and, you know, manage my weight and all that. So it's the things that you'll do, you know, they say that you know, the small hinges move big doors. Well, that's it. It's if you have the, the little things that you can do on a regular basis, that's where you're going to see the biggest growth. So find a marketing strategy that's designed for health coaches and is something that you can actually do, um, you know, and be consistent with. Okay, that's all for now. If you like that, I've got a lot more to say about this topic and helping helping health coaches um, attract client flow. Um, so if you want to follow along, please subscribe to the channel, um, like it, and feel free to share it. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.